What's up guys, Jason here at Tips Essentials with a um, tutorial on how to patch a system for custom themes that I'll be start making. So stay tuned for that. And the download link for the Windor file, which I usually uh, always use, is in the download link. I mean description, my bad. And it's going to be a media fire, which I always use because most reliable. And yeah, open up the Windor file or the raw file. And then um, move it to your desired location. I recommend your desktop. Yep. So open the folder up, and you'll see one one folder, one folder only. It's called Universal Theme Patcher, and just a bunch of numbers. That's a date. So open that folder up. You'll see five items, or four files, and one folder. Right now, this is the uh, um the good part. So. First, you need to right click your computer and go to property properties. You need to check your system type. It's going to say either 32 bit or 64 bit operating system. Make sure you get this right. Remember this number. This is the number you have to remember. So I have a 64 bit operating system. So you go back to the folder again. You'll see x64. So this one is for a 64 bit and this one is actually x88. 86 but it's actually for 32 bit so if you have 32 bit use x86 64 bit use x64 so make sure you get this right because this will screw up your computer like big time so just open the corresponding one right click and run as administrator i always recommend doing this when you're messing around with your computer because the last thing what you want to see is access denied that that this sucks so just click ok and it's going to tell you <laughs> your um, windows build windows operating system and it's going to say this os needs to patch three files and it's going to tell you three files has been patched and zero files need to be patched why because i patched them already <clears throat> so just click yes and then you'll be created with this window which you will click patch patch and patch but I uh, mine is patch already, so you'll need to patch it. So after you're done with this, it's gonna tell you to restart. You have to restart before you do anything. And after you restart, you will you can't see any changes. There's no way you can see a change. Except for your system files are uh like they're modified a little. A little. So yeah, you're done. Just go ahead and close everything exile everything and yeah you're done i just realized i said that twice so yeah thank you for watching please subscribe like and comment and peace out guys